Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some drinking balls. <laughs> we have the bacon cheeseburger with pickles, the ranch dill pickle, taco, and then we smoked cheddar jalapeno. These were sent to us from Rachel in Pennsylvania, and she ordered these for us from Sweet G's Bakery. And uh, so, uh, Sweet uh, G's Bakery doesn't just have sweets, they have stuff like this too. Savory. So this is www.sweetgsbakery.com, and they're in Pine Grove, uh, Pennsylvania, it looks like. Uh, bacon cheeseburger with pickles. It says four servings are in the container. Two thirds cup, 34 grams is 160 calories. That opened easy. Mm -hmm. Okay. So cheeseburger, pickle. Yeah. Bacon cheeseburger. Bacon cheeseburger and pickle. Definitely a smoky, like charred flavor. I think the pickle is a little bit of a dill flavor. I so they've added a little bit of um, dill weed or something like that in there. I think it's all dill, but I don't think it has the vinegar of a pickle. No, no. I don't think it's actually pickle. I think it's just dill. Right. Um, I don't get the bacon though at all. I don't get bacon, but I get the cheese and I get, I get, I get a little I, bit of cheese. I get the cheese and I get a hint of the smokiness. Like and a charred kind of. Right, and I'm wondering if that smokiness is supposed to represent bacon. Or just the cheeseburger part. Right, well, that's true, yeah. Because um, it's not like smoky bacon, it's more like a smoky grilled meat kind of flavor. Really, I'm getting. But it doesn't taste like meat, it's just smoky. The two main flavors for me <clears throat> are cheese and dill. That's it. I'm getting smoking dill. But I do, <laughs> um, I do like them. I like them too. The texture's a little different. The texture's a little different. The texture is the only place where it's like, I'm kind of iffy on it. It's kind of yeah. like popcorn. You can get really, really crispy popcorn, or you can get popcorn that's a uh, softer. softer. These are softer. Yeah. These aren't as crunchy as the uh, planters. Is it planters who, who makes those? They used to make those. Those right. cheese balls. She does make um, them. I kind of feel like cheese balls. Um, but these are not near that crunchy. Um, when you bite into it, it's almost its almost like they're stale, but not really. Like right, Because I don't think they're stale. I don't think they are either, but you do question it because you're the not used softer. to, yes, you're not used to that. Yeah. This is the ranch dill pickle. They like to use dill. They do like to <laughs> use dill, yes they do. But you can even see the dill we got. Mm -hmm. It's a ranch. I love the dill. These seem crunchier too. Mm -hmm. They do. These are these are the texture I want. Mm -hmm. These Those, are softer. Those are very crunchy. Mm -hmm. I tell you what, the salt content in that is like wow. Um, the sodium it's almost to the level of being too much for me. It's hard to read it. It looks like it's about five sixty something like that milligrams. Um, I think the. That is almost all dill for me, mm -hmm. and a really strong salt. And like mm -hmm. I said, it's, it's almost too much for me. Um, I it, love them. It almost like like burns the back of your throat. Oh when really? Salt's so strong. No, I could, I could eat and eat and eat those. Now I'm gonna be drinking a lot. I guess that's From why the salt. They're, they're drinking balls because they're gonna make you drink. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because you're gonna have so much salt that you're gonna you you're, you're just gonna, gonna have to drink. Um, the dill is also very, very strong. I love the dill flavor, so that's that's what I'm getting would, a lot of. Is, would you say it's ranch now? I don't get any ranch. No, really I don't not. get any ranch at all. It's just that strong dill, and yeah. I agree with you. I think, I think the dill kind of takes away whatever ranch is there, um, kind of takes that away. But I good. really, really like that. I like these much more than the cheeseburger. Now that I've eaten a couple of them, I don't get that. That really salty feeling in my back of my mouth. It's still pretty salty, but it wasn't that salty for me yeah, when I had it. So it, the first one, maybe the first one I got was just extra salty. It might have been. These are ooh, these are the ones I'm most excited about. Taco because I love taco flavors. Are these all the same? <coughs> these are all the same count. One sixty. I'm trying to get darker ones because <laughs> I want it this evening. 
This has gone back to that softer texture. Mm -hmm. It's taco seasoning is basically what it is. Doesn't that taste of like a little lime to you? Um, I, I can see where you would think that. I can't tell if I'm getting lime or if that's just chili powder. To me, it's taco, but it's primarily chili. You said chili powder, that's mm -hmm. what I was gonna say. The primary flavor in that is chili powder. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, strong chili powder. But I like it quite a bit because I like chili powder, even I like has, taco. Even has a little, there's no way I'm reading that. Um, it's very, very uh, heavy on the chili powder. Though. Yeah, almost to the point of, of burning. Oh, I like it. I, I have nothing against hot. it. Because I'm always, uh, when I have chili cheese fritos, I like them, but I could handle. I we, I always wish they were a little stronger on the chili. They make them pretty safe for everybody. Yeah, isn't I wish they were that strong. Yeah, these are very very strong, like on the chili. Mm -hmm. That's the kind of intensity that I like for yeah. for taco flavor because I really like that. But these lean more towards chili powder, not taco. For me. I agree. No, that's true. They could have called them chili. Mm -hmm. Chili cheese or something uh -huh. like that. If it had a little stronger cheese flavor. Okay, this is smoked cheddar jalapeno and it's same calories. Mm. You get that smoky flavor. Oh, yeah. And it tastes like a smoky cheese. This, oh, and then the jalapeno kicks in. Wow. These are crunchy again, by the way. Those are very spicy. They're very salty too. They are salty. The salt is 490 milligrams. Um, I'm amazed at the salt, I mean the smoke flavor. These have a lot going on. There's so many different flavors in that one little piece. You get a smoke flavor, I get cheese, I get the um, salt, lots and lots of salt, but I also get a really intense uh, burn from the jalapeno. Yeah. It's pretty strong. I don't necessarily get the green jalapeno know. flavor. Yeah, you don't taste the pepper flavor. Right, but you are experiencing the effects of it. it definitely has so, a good touch. So, There's a spreadable smoked cheese, like a really soft cheese that mm -hmm. has a really strong smoke to it. That's what that flavor reminds me of, is, is that spreadable cheese. I can't think of the brand, but um, it's really good. I like it. It's too hot though to eat normally. <laughs> the the um the only one of these I, these are too hot to enjoy yeah. for me too. I love the flavor, but it's just too hot. Yeah, so we will pass these on to to somebody else uh, that will enjoy them, so they will not be wasted. But um, it's too hot to enjoy. So even though I like it, it's too hot for me. Right. Um, my favorite is gonna be. Um, the, no, no, I, I really, really like the dill. I'm going to go with the ranch dill pickle as my number one, but I'm going to go for taco as my number two. Um, I think I would probably go with the ranch dill pickle, even though I said there was a lot of salt. I think I just got a, a really salty one. I do too. I think you did. Because the rest of them were fine. Yeah. Um, my second one's going to be the bacon cheeseburger. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah. But I do. I, that was a little, I liked that one, the taco one. Um, it was just a little strong on the chili powder for me, and I don't, I don't really. I mean, I like chili powder, but I don't like all chili powder. Yeah, and see me, it's you like, the, yeah, the more the the better. So um, I do think these are really good, good quality. I do not have a clue how much Rachel paid for these mm -hmm. or anything like that, but I'm sure if you go to SweetGeesBakery.com, you will be able to find out. And it's cool that they clearly don't just sell baked goods, but yeah. they sell these as well. Um, but I do think these are good quality. The only mm -hmm. one that I'm um, iffy on is the first one because it had a softer texture, and I do like the crispier texture. It did, and, and maybe it's a little older. You just don't, you just never you, know. No, you you have no idea. Mm -hmm. uh, but uh, these are this is something that's easy to snack on too, and so I would recommend you go check them out if you're. These interested. these are a, a bad for me because I take them out on the couch and just, and there just and eat pop them. By the time you realize that half the bag's gone. Yes. And that <laughs> so would be, you, you have to pour them out into a little bowl or something. Yeah, that'd be very easy to do. Mm -hmm. uh, but Rachel, thank you so much for sending them to us. Uh, if anybody else has ordered from Sweet G's Bakery, let us know because I would be curious what you ordered. And thanks for watching.